song's called I'm a Cunt. Show. Well, our van smells like ball sweat and cheese. High point for me, probably uh, playing with the Spitz oh, yeah. in Chicago. Now, now, now that's Chicago. Cleveland. Now that's class. Cleveland. Spitz and nobody. Yeah. Uh, that's because yeah. he got a rim job. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we've been traveling for like the last 10 years and we make a lot of friends and it's, it's difficult to make friends on the road and then not see them for years and years and years and just reuniting with friends and having this, like debauchery and, and drunken kisses. We played some rock and roll all over this northwest, east, and south. Yes. Yeah. And now uh, Atlanta. Atlanta and Santa Cruz. Those were your, yeah, Atlanta was good. But well, would you all come back? To of course. Of course. Yep. Yeah. Thank you, Andrea, and thank you, Unibombers, for letting us be here. And for accommodating Moto, too. Jesus Christ, that was awesome. I say no fuck. I say yes, Bob. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh my god, I don't know what two songs we gotta play. Dance, dance, just one of them. Oh, my god, we gotta get away from the cop! Oh, my dad is, okay, do it. started in the early 80s in, uh, in New Orleans, which is where I'm from, New Orleans, uh, and uh, I got started with uh, some friends of mine, and uh, I ended up moving in around 1987, and I uh, lived in Boston and Chicago, but I kept the band going. It's getting close to 30 years of Moto, yeah, so like uh, a lot of time playing music, which is what I've always enjoyed. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, it's not really a mission statement, I don't really have a plan to take over the world or anything like that. I mean, I'd like to make a living, that'd be nice. Too. 